it's Lindsay. I'm just popping in with a little bonus video. I wanted to unbox my monthly jewelry subscription box from Kristen D. Um, if you're new here, I do sell part-time on Poshmark and also The Real Real. My normal videos drop every Monday and Thursday at 8 p.m. Eastern. If you're not subscribed, please consider doing so. Uh, please hit the bell notification also as so you don't miss a bonus video like this and also the thumbs up for me. I'm getting so close to 1K subscribers. Um, I really appreciate appreciate everybody um, who's stuck in there with me. Um, I've been doing this now for just about a year and um, it's been a long journey and I'm just so excited that we're almost there. So um, let's see what we got. This is my uh, mystery jewelry subscription um, from Kristen D. She is a fellow YouTuber and reseller and um, I will post her information in the description box. She does run um, these through her Patreon and they run $34.99 and that includes tax and shipping. You get six pieces of jewelry. They are all brand names and quality pieces that she handpicks herself. So they're a great price point if you want to resell the items or keep them for yourself, gift them. You can do a mix with everything. So, hi Lindsay, here's your October jewelry subscription box. Enjoy, love Kristen. Um, so it's, yeah, this is October. All right, let's take a look here. First up, we do have a necklace. And this is a silver chain. And then it has these little station accents, um, a double layer. So that's really pretty. And let's see if I can flip that over here. Um, that is a Premier Designs. That's great. Um, really nice brand. I've gotten a few of their pieces from Kristen, so that is very nice. And this is super pretty and colorful. This is um, a necklace and um, very bright colors, uh, little seed beads. So it looks like it's a collar necklace. And it has these little um, hammered gold tone, little shield things on top. This is really pretty, very boho. And let's see if I can see where the, oh, this is loft actually. I wasn't expecting that. Um, that says loft there and it has a little rhinestone. So I love that, very pretty. Next, we have another silver piece with rhinestone. And this is a um, kind of a black metal or gun metal. And it's another double layer. And then it has the tassel down here. Covered in rhinestones, very blingy. And this one is... Let me get my magnifying glass here. Uh, Lydell NYC. There's a hang tag there. I haven't heard of that brand. Um, that's just a little bit tangled there, but I think I got it out. So just a long tassel necklace, um, multi-layer, and it is adjustable. So that is super pretty. Nice for a night out for some bling. And next I have a pair of earrings, and these are new on the card, Leah Sophia. Um, those are a mixed metal. There's like a copper tone, gold tone, dark silver, and lighter silver. So really pretty dangle earrings. And next I have another necklace. This is beautiful. Really pretty um, different shades of pinks. I really like this one and it's gold tone and let's see what this one is 
believe this one is Avon. So gorgeous. I love the colors on that. Really pretty for spring and summer. And lastly, we have this uh, another dark silver necklace um, with these gorgeous beads. And it comes together and has the longer, um, I think it's called like a lariat type style. And this one, I believe, is Ann Taylor. It has the little butterfly logo there. So, um, again, it's really super pretty um, for a night out. I love it. So, um, we had the Leah Sophia earrings, the Avon necklace the Loft necklace, the uh, Premier Designs, the Lydell, and the, I believe, Ann Taylor. So another great box. Um, I really love everything. Um, these two are probably my favorite pieces. Let me know what your favorite item was. Um, again, I think these boxes are a great value to get six pieces of quality jewelry. Um, so I look forward to getting these every month. Um, thank you so much, Kristen. And, um, before we go, I did just want to talk briefly about, um, something that I do on Poshmark that I'm sure you're aware of. Um, but if you're not, it could be something to help with your sales, um, is relisting your items. And, um, by relisting, I don't mean, you know, like actually, going in and creating a whole new listing but using the copy feature so what i do every day is i pull my inventory report and when an item is 61 days on the inventory report i can use the copy feature to create a new listing and when you do that that will show the item as just in so you know the default search right now is just shared but a lot of people will change their search to show, um, you know, just in. So if you do use the copy feature, it has to be um, in inventory for at least 60 days. So I just wait till 61 to be safe. Um, so when you create a new listing, you will lose all of the current likers. So keep that in mind. Um, but by that point, 60 days in, you've probably already sent them at least one offer. Um, and you know, I've had really good luck doing that. You know, sometimes I've had the item sitting for the two months, offer sent, nothing's happening. I copy it, have a new listing and it'll sell the same day. Just getting a fresh set of eyes on the item. So I, I highly encourage you to do that. And when you're pulling your inventory report, you can kind of see, you know, what items are approaching the 60 days. And then at that point, maybe you want to send out, you know, your rock bottom offer to see if you can sell it um, to the current people that are, you know, liking it before you relist it. But, you know, at that point, if somebody hasn't bought it in two months, I don't, I don't really foresee that they're going to buy it in the future. So um, just a little tip that I like to do that, that does help um, increase my sales. And another thing that I like to do, um, we have a closet clear out on Poshmark every Sunday and Friday. So instead of just randomly dropping prices on items, for anybody that is liking my items on those days, what I do is add the item to a bundle and let them know you know, for today's closet clear out, I can drop the price to such and such and Poshmark will automatically apply discounted shipping of $4.99 for you at checkout. And then that way, if they say yes, then you can go ahead and lower the price and then they get discounted shipping without it coming out of your pocket. I find this to be much more effective than just randomly cutting prices because then once you've done that, you know, you may have somebody send you an offer that's lower than you'd want to go because you've already discounted it for closet clear out. And then, you know, what do you do at that point? Are you going to raise the price back up? Um, or you may have to just, you know, relist the item if it doesn't sell during the closet clear out because it's only good for six hours once you lower the price. So I do have a lot of success um, doing that, you know, more so than just sending blind offers because then I can discount the item a little bit more than I could 
just doing like a 20% off, um, I can do a little bit additional because I know Poshmark is covering the discounted shipping. So I just want to share those two things with you. It's nothing new um, and maybe something that you're already doing, but if you haven't, um, especially with the relisting of your items um, at the 61 day mark, I would highly encourage you to try that. Um, and see if it works for you. And if it does, let me know. Um, or if you guys have any other selling tips um, that you'd like to share with me, um, you know, and the other viewers, uh, please leave in the comments below. So I appreciate you tuning in and I will see you on the next video. Uh, thanks again, Kristen, and I will link all of her information in my description box. Take care.